Hi, this is Ashok here. I am a trainer for CFA and you are watching Phoenix training YouTube channel where I make content pertaining to CFA and investment banking topics. This video will graphically explain the payoff for long call options. Okay, for long call option. So, payoff as in, uh, what do you mean by payoff? Payoff is the net obligations net amount uh, net amount or net profit and loss calculations net profit and loss calculations graphically uh, we are going to see this payoff for long call option but shortly if i tell you uh, what is long call uh, long call so there is you know x and y x is x is long x is long or he is also called as the holder y is short and he is also called as the writer and imagine they both have entered into a contract you know worth for let's say the contracts value is 100 and uh, 100 and holder is supposed to pay premium so holder is paying 10 as the premium so 10 is the premium so in this case because he has paid 10 so his break even point will be 110 because he is going to get profit only beyond 110 okay and let's say in this case it goes to 130 so when it goes to 130 the price of the underlying asset when it goes to 130 or the spot price goes to 130 on the expiry date so the holder will make a net profit of 20 how because from 100 it has gone to 130 so he will make 30 profit but he has already paid 10 as premium so his net profit will be his net profit will be 20 and his break even point when he was at no profit no loss that was 110 in this case here in 110 he was having no profit no loss so break even points formula will be strike price that is 100 this 100 is called as the strike price the price at which they both have agreed to enter into the contract plus premium premium 10 so 100 plus 10 is called as the break even point now if i have to show all this graphically how will i do okay so i draw a graph over here so imagine this is 100 okay this is the price and this is so this is the price and this is the profit y axis is the profit okay profit and loss so this is zero okay and above all these are profit below all these are losses so let me write here 10 profit 20 and then 30 similarly here minus 10 okay so now the moment i enter into the contract i am losing okay I'm, so payoff is from the holders perspective so i am the holder so i am losing 10 because i have paid premium so that means i am actually standing over here the moment i enter into the contract because i have already lost 10 so i am standing here and then what happens the price goes up imagine okay so this is 100 and let me take this as 110 120 okay this is 90 130 okay 140 this way so now when the price is reaching to 110 so imagine the price has gone up from 100 it has gone to 110 so when it has gone to 110 okay So when it has gone to 110 uh, here graphically that means I invested 100 sorry I you know entered into a contract worth for 100 but now it is worth for 110 okay and I paid 10 as premium so I am at break even point no profit no loss so graphically it will be represented like this so this graph will go up and it will stand over over here 
so it will stand over here this this is this is break even point now further when it is going up imagine it has gone up to 120 so when it has gone up to 120 i am making 10 profit because still 110 i did not make any profit so when it reaches to 120 i'll make 10 profit so graphically it will be shown like this when it reaches to 130 so graphically again it will it will go here reason being this this indicates 20 profit here okay and this indicates 10 profits here so this is this is the graph uh, for call options okay call option holders point of view and uh, uh, and what is this now i can draw a line like this also reason being suppose if the price comes down below below 90 i mean below 100 so if the price comes down below 100 i am not going to you know lose anything beyond uh, premium so when it comes to below 100 let's say it reaches to 90 still my loss will be the premium so that's why i will uh, you know the graph graphically i will show my payoff over here suppose it goes to 80 still i will show the payoff over here only if it goes to 70 still here because my loss will not go lower than 10 so that's why this line you know drawn like this over here so this is the payoff uh, for uh, call option and as the price keeps going up this graph also will keep going up over here so this is this is the payoff for call options So, payoff for put options. Payoff for put options. So, payoff is the calculation of uh, net profit and loss. And the payoff for put options, graphically, I am going to show this to you. Okay. So, before showing graphically, let me just take one quick example. Uh, so, X, Y. So, X is the holder who believes the price will come down. And he is also called as long on put is long on put and why is the uh, why is the writer he is called as short short on put so he expects the price to go up and imagine they both have entered into a contract for the strike price 100 so this is the strike price and holder is supposed to pay premium so holder has paid premium of 10 okay so yeah i'm not explaining put option over here there is another video if you want to know you know exactly what is put option here i'm just quickly telling you the payoff for put option okay so this is one example so now imagine so in this case a uh, holder wants the price to go uh, down and so accordingly the price has come down let's say it has come down to uh, 70 so how much profit will the holder get so 100 minus 70 so he's going to get 30 profit but however he already paid premium so that's why because he already paid premium of 10 so his net profit will be his net profit will be uh, uh, you know 30 he got 30 minus 10 that is equal to 20 okay he's going to get net profit of 20 and suppose if the question is like what is the break even point so break even point is that means when there was no profit or loss remember when he entered into the contract he already incurred a loss of 10 so when it reached to 90 okay that was the time when he did not have any profit or loss okay because here he is getting profit of 10 100 is reaching to 90 he is getting profit of 10 and he paid 10 as premium so his net profit and loss is zero so all this if i have to show this graphically how do i do that's what this video is all about so let's say this is 100 this is the spot price and this is profit and loss you know y axis is all profit and loss profit and loss so this is 0 and imagine this is 10 20 okay similarly here this is loss minus 10 okay so now when this is let's say 110 90 80 70 because the you know the holder wants the price to go down okay so now when the price is 100 he is entering into the contract and that means the holder is going to pay 10 so automatically he is at the loss of 10 
okay so he is at the loss of 10 so graphically his payoff is over here and then when the price comes down to 90 he wants the price to come down right so holder or long on put option or the holder wants the price to come down so when the price comes down he is happy he is making uh, profit so when the price is coming down so what happens is his loss will also come down so slowly his loss is coming down and at 90 which is the break even point he has no profit or loss this is his break even point and further when the price goes to 80 he is incurring 10 loss uh, sorry 10 profit he is incurring 10 profit okay this is incurring 10 profit and then when it goes to 70 when it goes to 70 he is incurring so this graph will go like this is incurring 20 profit okay is incurring a profit of 20 right so this is graphically how payoff is drawn for put options okay and suppose if the price goes up okay contradiction contradictory to his uh, prediction imagine the price is go, going up to 110 so in that case his maximum loss will be 10 only he is not going to execute the contract so it will be 10 so imagine it is reaching to 110 so which is not liked by the holder so at that time also his loss will be 110 uh, only the amount that he has paid as premium if it goes to 120 even at that time his loss will be only 10 so that's why this line will go like this here the loss whereas the profit will go this way so this is the payoff for put option thank you